Hi, welcome to Camixel Technologies YouTube channel and in this video we will be seeing how to stream with Ada Mini Xtreme using a smartphone. So Ada Mini Xtreme has two USB-C outputs where you can connect it directly to a laptop and you can start streaming that is one and two is you can use your ethernet to give an internet connection to the Ada Mini Xtreme and use the inbuilt hardware streaming feature to stream in YouTube or Facebook but let's say you are out somewhere and you don't have any internet facility you don't have anything but your smartphone okay this will really help you so I have a smartphone over here I have a simple smartphone which is basically I think it is a Samsung smartphone and it has a USB-C port here we are just going to just connect it to the Atom Mini Xtreme so this feature allows uh, us to use the internet connection of the smartphone using the inbuilt hardware feature we are going to stream this so I'm going to just connect it to this over here so basically it does a basic charging point and it has no other feature for example to check whether your connection is good or bad you can just hit on air and you can see it, it is going on air properly there is no problem over here so let me off it I'm going to show you how to set this up in simple ways so in this phone you need to select your when when you select this you need to make sure this is this device and you USB tethering should be on okay coming to the atom mini software control you can see the blue dot over here which means the hardware is taking the internet connection and you can set up your platform youtube primary and key so it's very simple the key is over here just copy the key and come over here and paste the key right very simple and i'm going to hit on air over here you can see that blink a simple blink which means the stream is not good if there is no blink in on air the stream is really good and it is going good so you can come to your youtube page and check what is going in stream let's say i'm going to switch it to source number one and i'm going to hit auto for a transition you can see the stream happens here as well so camera number one is now on the pgm and it will automatically update over here it's quite simple so that is basically streaming let's say you, your internet connection is cut off how do i know it so let's say I plug out my USB-C connection you can see when the moment when the moment the internet connection is gone you can see the blinking happening over here stating that okay your internet connection is not stable please do something so we can connect immediately connect our smartphone and we can select this device and USB threading and immediately you can see there is an improvement over here you can see the blinking will stop the blinking stops after the USB threading and you can see your uh, YouTube page as well for your external connection input it's quite simple easy so this is all about USB streaming just connect it and it's very very simple for different phones it will be a different uh, settings over here but it's basically there but for iPhone users just connect you don't need to do anything it will do everything automatically so no need of external software nothing just connect it make sure your ADAM setup is set to priority in to mobile connection if you want to do it and if you are using ethernet yes via ethernet also you can bring internet and use your inbuilt streaming now i am not connected anything to my laptop laptop is empty you can see the atom switcher panel nothing is connected it is using the inbuilt streaming feature to send your signal to youtube or whatever platform you prefer this is all about streaming via smartphone using usb c connectivity We'll be coming up with more videos from now. Stay tuned and stay safe. 